Well, we are just a few days away from thunder over Louisville. Airplanes and fireworks will take over the sky, but you'll see something else too. Wave News reporter Sean Bowdy is live in the studio to explain what is it, Sean? <laughs> well, Don, there's a little something for everyone in the air Saturday. You know that. The airplanes, yeah, they're cool, but what I'm keeping an eye out for are the people jumping out of them. 4,000 feet in the air, 400,000 people on the ground. Perhaps Van Halen said it best, might as well jump. Oh, it's awesome. It's, it's really cool being able to, to see everybody from the bird's eye view. Major Brian Hunt is no stranger to this part of the atmosphere. He's a combat veteran and a Purple Heart recipient. Nerves, not really a thing on Thunder Day when he jumps from a moving C-130. Your brain gets into that, that training mindset, and uh, you obviously want to perform no matter what it is that you're doing. Uh, putting a million people down there or 600,000, whatever it is, it really doesn't change it for us. Back on base, the Kentucky Air National Guard, a rigorous rigging routine. It's just another day in what we do. Master Sergeant Mark Motzinger says the guard packs a lot of parachutes. Basically what I'm looking for is that all the lines are right here to the center. Thunder is basically just another training day. All of that parachute will go into this little bag. I did learn a thing or two as well about putting the packed parachute on my back, knowing full well I have no intention of ever using one. All right, I'm all geared up, and let me just tell you, this thing right here, it's not light. They may make it look easy, but these guys are professionals. It's certainly not as easy as just doing that. The 123rd Special Tactics Squadron is well-versed in para-rescue, a training process that often lands them in water. Really, though, it's just a small part of what they do. It is of utmost importance to show the public what, what we have to offer and what it is that we can bring to them as a nation. Major Hunt will be the last one out of the plane for their thunder jump. He's thinking about the safety of other jumpers and also something else. It's pride. Uh, it's being proud of all the guys that have been able to do this and make it through all the rigorous training to get to this point. The honor of watching the people he's helped train grow. I couldn't be more proud. Is a sensation not even a three-quarter mile free fall can match. The eight jumpers from the Air National Guard will practice once on Friday, Don, and it all goes to plan. Weather-wise, they'll do it in front of the thundercloud crowd on Saturday. Reporting live in studio, Sean Bowdy, Wave News. Sean.